In this video, we're going to look at how to create path from Glex Animate into Kden Live. So we can be able to create animation in Glex Animate and using it in Kden Live. So the latest update of Kden Live 22.802, you are able to see when in the project window, you do a right click and you can see create animation. But you can create that in Glex Animate and now you can create a JSON file to use it in Kden Live. So let's see how we can do that. First of all, you have to download Glex Animate. So I put a link in the description below for the link into the official website for Glex Animate. And here you are able to download the version of your Windows, whether Windows, uh, Mac or other Linux. And then once you download that, uh, you need to unzip that. When you unzip it, and now you can be able to link it or create a part into Kden Live. So let's move to Kden Live and see how we can do that. So here in Kden Live, when you go to the settings, and you go all the way to configure Kden Live, and in the configuration of Kden Live, you go to the environment. And in the environment, you can see you have MLT environment, you have default folders and default apps. So in the default apps, you have the image editing and this is for Krita. And then you have the audio editing and this is for Audacity. And here we have the animation editing. And this is where we're going to create the part into it. So remember where we uh, unzip our Glex Animate uh, folder into. And now click in the chains. And then you can see this uh, open file dialog here. Click on that to open the file dialog. And then you go straight to where you unzip your file into it. Now here we can see uh, we have the Glex Animate folder here. So first of all, you're going to unzip it with this folder. And then you open it to go into this folder. And then you open this folder to go into bin, share, and Glex Animate. Now inside the bin, you open it up and you can see this Glex Animate and the type will be application. So once you have that, select that and then click open and then here click OK and then apply that and then click OK. That's all you need to do to create a part into Kden Live. Now in the Kden Live project bin, you do a right click and click on create animation. Once you click that, you have this little dialog box up, simply click OK. And you can see it's creating a JSON file here in the project bin. And it's also going to open up Glex Animate. So you can see now it's able to open up Glex Animate, a vector animation software here. And now you're able to create some animation here or motion graphics here. And then you can save it and use it in Kden Live. So in the next video, we're going to look at how to do that in Glex Animate. Thank you for watching. See you back again in another video.